when our homes became our offices and schoolwork was done on the breakfast table, the line between work and private time disappeared. YouTube helped to educate and entertain during these times while inspiring a sense of community. Work and life crossed over and forced content creators to rely less on the aesthetic and use their homes as a backdrop too. This inspired more authenticity and viewers loved it. Viewers rate the body coach, aka Joe Wick's down to earth approach to the extent that he won a Guinness World Record for most viewers for a fitness workout live stream on YouTube. Another example is The Daily Show. It moved from a big production studio to host Trevor Noah's home. He filmed everything on his smartphone and it paid off as the show's YouTube viewership grew by 45% versus the year before. In India, comedian Zamai Rayner started to live stream chess games, making them funny, entertaining and full of personality to make chess more relatable to wider audiences. Also, look at Mr. Beast. He was the top US creator on YouTube, with his videos being watched over 1 billion times in just one month. His laid back, relatable presenting style has made him a big hit across the world and has become a top creator in the UK too. What does this mean for marketers? Authenticity wins. Informality and realism are here to stay. To create impactful video content, it's not about high production, fancy backdrops or script perfect content. Today, speaking the same language as your viewers is what brings them genuinely closer to you. Also, think about creators who can help tell your brand story to wider audiences. Dive deeper into the trends on Think With Google and subscribe for our next videos in this series.